Hello, my name is Jason Harrelson, and today I'm going to discuss the Standing Wave Efficiency Trim Kit. Here at Harrelson Trumpets, we call them SWE Trim Kits, S-W-E. This is a SWE Trim Kit right here, and I wish I could claim that I had invented the Trim Kit. Uh, I guess the part that, that I did was I really specifically made this available to almost all trumpets, cornets, flugelhorns, uh, etc as an upgrade kit that can be added to any instrument and it will improve the efficiency of the way it plays. Or in other words, it'll make playing the horn easier. So, a standing wave efficiency trim kit simply screws right onto a horn. And here I have uh, an old Bach trumpet and a trim kit. And I'm going to unscrew the parts. Alright, so here I've taken on. the top caps off and the finger buttons. And I'm screwing on the new Harrelson trim kit top caps which are heavier and they improve the efficiency. Now I have the top caps and the finger buttons on and you can see the alignment is the same as it was with an original Bach trim kit. Now with the bottom caps it looks like this horn is probably from the 80's. It's pretty grimy whoever uh, traded this in didn't really take the time to clean it, but the new parts should just thread right on. Without even cleaning all that crud, they still screw on. I'm a little bit surprised because that's pretty dirty. So now we have a trim kit on a box Stradivarius. SWE, or standing wave efficiency, applies to the standing wave, which is the wave we set in motion inside the horn. Literally, there's a resonating column of air between your mouth and the end of the horn. When that creates a vibration in the instrument, then the energy has been converted to motion of the instrument, and we don't want that. So the standing wave, or SWE trim kit, prevents that motion and it keeps more energy in your wave itself. So let's try it out. So it's very easy to slur two octaves on this horn. Um, easier than it was without the trim kit. And of course it gets easier and easier as the instrument is more efficient. This is a medium trim kit. So this is the half inch length in brass and the one that I put on today has some special iridescent glass finger button inlays. For that we'll go out to the lathe which I will turn on right now. Okay, to make a trim kit, we start with solid bar stock. So this is a solid bar of brass, and this is fed through the spindle of the lathe. So the lathe is booting up right now, but you can see there's a bar in there right now. And this is for a finger button. And uh, basically what happens is we put it in the lathe, and we spin it and then we remove metal with various cutters and then we create threading and any other designs, custom designs people may want uh, on the trim kits. So they're made on a CNC lathe which is very accurate. This particular lathe is accurate to far more than a, a thousandth of an inch. So we can hold tolerances that are a fraction of a thousandth. This particular lathe is better than most ways trim kits are made because one, we're programming it and testing the parts, but also because it has a sub-spindle, so all the parts are cut in one setup. Both ends of the parts are cut in one setup. The way we used to make trim kits was by hand on a manual lathe, and this is the new improvement. So, this is uh, how they're made, and uh, if you watch future videos, we'll actually have several machining videos up soon that show the actual production and machining.
Sweet trim kits come in various sizes, uh, light, medium, and heavy. And that is primarily because people ask for different sizes. The truth is, in all the testing I've done, the medium size is almost in, as efficient as the heavy size. You, most people don't really need the heavy unless you like the look of it or unless you need that extra just tiny bit of efficiency that you gain from the three quarter inch heavy. This is a three quarter inch heavy bottom cap. And I'll just hold it up here so you can compare to the half inch. It's 50% bigger. Now, the lightweight ones, or the thinner ones, are 3 eighths of an inch, and you can see they're considerably smaller. The one I'm holding is an aluminum. That's the lightest. You can have any of the sizes in the bottom caps, top caps, and finger buttons in aluminum. In the future, we will have anodized aluminum, so you can get black or school colors or whatever else you would like. So, heavy brass light aluminum. We have other variations here. There's a medium copper, which is tarnishing. Here's rose gold top cap. These over here are all 24 karat gold plated. Here we have a custom bottom cap that was made for a satellite trumpet. It's very custom, a lot of machining. Other variations include power inlays in the bottom caps or in the finger buttons. And this one has some initials milled out in it. This one has initials engraved. And uh, here's even a gemstone inlay. And again, some engraving on the side. So there are a lot of different variations and options. Finger buttons, we have almost 200 different inlays. We cut our inlays here ourselves. We do the lapidary work, uh, smooth them out. We also do acrylic caps or glass caps on so the So sweet lens. trim kits are available for all makes and models of trumpets. If for some reason we don't have your sizes on file, that means I haven't measured them yet, then all you would need to do is send your trumpet in and I would measure all the parts and create a new part that would fit your horn. Keep in mind there are lots of variations and options. You can have any design put around any of the trim kits a floral design, your initials, your name, your phone number, whatever you like. Uh, you also have the option of different inlays. And a side note, uh, these are custom mouthpieces that I have made. This one is hand carved. This one also is hand carved. And this one was milled on a machine. And this is my segue into another video that you will see soon on various mouthpieces in our new five-piece modular mouthpiece system. So, I hope that you've learned a little bit about sweet trim kits, and please call us with your questions or to place an order. Thanks.